Hey everyone, I just wanted to kind of give everyone a heads up that I have been considering trying to update my YouTube channel, but it's a little bit intimidating, the Google emergence with YouTube, and it's been kind of complicated, and I'm just not, I don't have the time to try to sit down and figure out all these different programs, but the point of this is saying that I wanted to give glory to our Heavenly Father and all all praise and power to him and so i have hopefully i have gone in and was able to change the name of this channel to declare his glory i still have lisa brown and my remember paul revere which was my initial youtube account and i'm not sure how this is going to show up in tags or, or what have you but anyway i just want to kind of let everyone know that that's what i'm doing but I wanted to also express that it is my great pleasure as I do my studies here at home to share those with my brothers and sisters in Christ because I am a truth seeker. I love to learn about the truth of the Lord and it gives me great pleasure to share this with others that are also looking for that truth and it is out of this love of the truth that I also share in love with my brothers and sisters. And so hopefully we can all together come to that discernment that our Heavenly Father would want us to have. And to be a good servant unto Him according to His will. I just wanted to let y'all know I'm doing a little update, do a, a little bit of a different look to glorify our Lord and and not myself. Anyway, I hope that this new update on the channel is something that is appealing to everyone. I never intended for this channel to have my name. It was the Google emergence that kind of threw everything off because it was like wanting my name or it wouldn't go through and all this anyway it was really complicated and I just didn't have time to mess with it and I quickly wanted to point out under about on my channel I just wanted you to know that I do welcome polite civil Christian debate I do not expect everyone to agree or to understand everything that I'm talking about and if there's something that you do not understand by all means please ask a question or if you think of it and you think it's a different way, by all means, let's discuss it. And let's try to figure it out and discern these things from between us. But now anyone comes on my channel and they start name calling or degrading me in any form or fashion, they'll get the ax. That's just the way it is. I don't have time to tolerate a bunch of troll activity or spam. Uh, do not come on here and just post a whole bunch of scriptures out of context. Also, I wanted to point out that the heart of the righteous studied to answer, but the mouth of the wicked poureth out evil things. This is Proverbs 15, 28. The reason why I've posted this is to my detractors, because there's a lot of evil spirits running around on YouTube as well as other social media. They're stalkers and trollers. They create massive amounts of videos. They cloak themselves under different IDs in order to try to create confusion and strife between brothers and sisters. Their attacks are, are generated in almost every case. Vicious attacks against Christians. This makes them antichrist. They are anti-Christians and they claim to be Christians but they are anti-Christ. We know them by their fruits. You can check their channels out and there's just nothing but attack video after one after another under, I mean, hundreds probably by now of different IDs. Discern this for yourself and stay away from them because, I mean, they are vicious little vipers who plays both sides. They'll appear to be very sweet and ask questions and all this kind of stuff at the beginning only to get close to you only to turn around and try to demonize you under a different ID this is the way that they work this is the way they move around on YouTube and in other social media so be watchful I have a video called accusing spirits 
and that was my that's my banner toward these trolls these antichrist trolls who create all this strife and our heavenly father is against it we discern them by their fruit so discern all of this as a christian just be watchful and how blessed are we to be teaching or spreading the glory of our heavenly father and our lord jesus christ and to be attacked for that very thing we are very blessed so but be watchful of their snares because that's what they do they're just unbelievable but anyway so this is my response to them I am not affiliated regardless of what some may say I am not affiliated in any way with Shepherd's Chapel I am a student of Shepherd's Chapel and I thank God every day for their teachings chapter by chapter and verse by verse our Heavenly Father instructs us it's in his word to learn his word line by line precept upon precept that means take it to topic to topic we do not have English teachers in the US anymore they do not teach what a verb is or what a noun is or an adjective I mean they do not teach these things anymore obviously because very few seem to understand what the subject is um, so anyway but I highly recommend Shepherd's Chapel if you wish to learn using a King James Version Bible go study with them because they do they are the most excellent teachers that I have ever found and I have studied listen to many different churches their doctrines their teachers their preachers and i have yet to find any that can even come close to shepherd's chapel i do have some on my on watch list that are also either currently or in the past have been shepherd chapel students that also teach the word and it does not mean that they are affiliated with Shepherd's Chapel any more than I am. Once God gives you that truth, when you learn the truth of His Word, it's there. And you just understand it. And when you learn it by precept and, on, and line by line, it's, it becomes so much clearer. And you want to share that. And that's what they do. And so, anyway. Also have eSword. It's a free... King James Version Bible download for your computer and I have the website right here I also have a blog which I neglect horribly but anyway I just I have it listed here and then I also have my remember Paul Revere my other account I don't know I hardly ever post anything on there I might try to keep it updated from time to time but anyway I just wanted you to know this and also to understand that I'm not affiliated in any way with anyone else on YouTube regardless of what others may say or claim they are lying they're just flat liars they're, they create strife with their trolling and their vicious attack videos in order to cause confusion I highly recommend you know for you anybody that does those kind of videos it's very obvious what they're doing use common sense and go check out the ones that they're attacking to find out what the hoopla is about because you're gonna find that they're lying I can guarantee it these attackers these false accusers they are working evil in the world and we will all be judged according to our works and there there's a day coming all there all the evil works that's being perpetrated out there on YouTube and other places it's all going to come back on their evil heads so there it is I hope that they repent and see the light but if they don't well then may God you know put the punishment on top of their little pointed head my channels are nonprofit I have never asked for money I have no need for outside funding Heavenly Father provides the means and the abilities that bring these videos to fruitation and that does not mean that that is true for everyone because I know that some people have jobs that they have to work at and then they do videos on the side and they spend a lot of time and money on equipment and and what have you so I mean if you're fed there by all means if you feel like sending a donation to them that's perfectly 
fine and biblical. So anyway, I just wanted that to be known. But I, at this point, do not, I do not require funding. So I present these videos free of charge, nonprofit, for a learning and teaching experience for others to please go study our Heavenly Father's Word for yourself. And I also recommend a good King James Version Bible or this eSword program because it also has the Strong's with the Greek and Hebrew Aramaic translations that makes it so much easier to understand our Heavenly Father's Word as we have just done these past studies. I'm, sh I'm hoping I'm, that by doing it this way that it will teach others the this wonderful tool that is so helpful in your studies when you're trying to understand and discern what our Heavenly Father and our Lord Jesus Christ is talking about. And I'm very thankful to our Heavenly Father for providing the means in my life that allows me to have this time to study His Word and the abilities to be able to make these videos to share with others that are looking and searching for His truth. And I wanted to thank all those who watch these videos, who support me with their kind comments. I wanted to thank each and every one of you, and I, I do appreciate your support as we study our Heavenly Father's Word and as we learn so many truths. I mean, every study I learn something new, and I'm so very thankful to our Heavenly Father for that discernment, and I, I appreciate others' comments, you know, their insight. I, I do appreciate it, and I just wanted to apologize. I know that sometimes I get into my little rants, and I hope that you, those who are subscribed to me and follow my videos, I hope that you really truly understand that I'm not ranting at you. I'm ranting at the world. I'm ranting at the circumstances that has brought about the false doctrines or the situations. I I don't, it's not my intention to hurt anyone's feelings or to alienate anyone. It's, I don't know, it's just, I, I just feel so, I get so wrapped up and sometimes I just kind of get, if I'm reading something and I just know and it just kind of, I kind of go into a rant and I hope that you will just overlook me when I go into those little rants because I can't seem to control them all the time and, but just please know that I'm not ranting at you. Just say, oh man, she's just having a rant. She, let her rant out because she'll be okay. And I always am. Uh, but anyway, I just wanted you to know that I'm not ranting at you. I'm ranting at the deception in the world that we are having to sort through and the confusion. So anyway, I love you all. And I would never want to hurt anyone. So th with that said, I, I hope that you will just take all of this in stride and we'll muddle through and try to overcome Lisa's rants because I do have them and I do get angry at some of the stuff that I see and but just know that it's not angry at you so it's at the situation and, and the evil in the world that's going on around us so I hope that I haven't messed up everything on this channel but if so I guess if you've got my link we're all still linked together and so that'll be just fine with me. God bless everyone, and I look forward to our next study together.